The president's budget proposal eliminates public media funding. Learn how you can help at lptv.org slash action. A Bemidji Middle School assistant principal had his first a court appearance after he was arrested on suspicion of soliciting minors. Armel Meyer was in Beltrami County District Court with Brandon Bjorkness and has the details. Brandon Bjorkness is facing two felony counts of engaging in electronic communication relating or describing sexual conduct with a child. According to court documents, the Beltrami County Sheriff's Department started an investigation in January for a Facebook account under the name Brett Larson, supposedly a 13-year-old from Duluth. By tracking the IP address, law enforcement was led to 34-year-old Brandon Mark Bjorkness's home in Bemidji. During a search of the property, a statement was taken from Bjorkness, during which he admitted to creating the Facebook account and had accessed the page from several different devices. On a seized cell phone, law enforcement found a Snapchat account where two separate juvenile victims sent photos and texts back and forth describing sexual acts. Bjorkness later admitted that he knew that they were under 15. Law enforcement confirmed the nature of the conversations with the 13 and 14 year old victims. During today's arraignment hearing, his defense attorney argued for a lower bail amount due to his small criminal history. According to an official at the Beltrami County Jail, Bjorkness is no longer in custody tonight. The Sheriff's Department would not comment directly on the case, but they did release a statement asking for parents to talk to their kids to see if they had any contact with the persona Brett Larson. In Bemidji, I'm Mel Meyer, Lakeland News. Bjorkness is expected to have an omnibus hearing on April 17th at the Beltrami County Courthouse. While this has been playing out over the past 48 hours, parents are raising concerns over the school district's handling of the situation. At Bemidji Middle School today, parents were shocked at the news. Lori Lynn Dakota says she was surprised to hear about Brandon Bjorkness because her daughter and granddaughter attend the middle school. We send our kids to school with people we trust, and now this comes up. Do I homeschool her? What do you do? It's sick. It's nasty. Some parents were bothered by the timeliness in response by the Bemidji School District. The school district was made aware of the complaint on March 20th, but parents weren't made aware until days later. We just found out about it last night, so the delay in time, that's not, that's not good. I mean, I'm speechless now. This is an ongoing investigation and we'll keep you up to date as the story develops. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.